Hi, my name is Andy Pugh, I'm actually one of my students, in which case just Mr Pugh, and I'm Physics Med. Quick little one today, you might want to try at home, this is one that I've practiced a lot. I have a drawing pin. You might sometimes wonder how a drawing pin will go into a wall that doesn't go into your thumb. And it's all about the concept of pressure. There's two parts of a drawing pin. There's the, the base, which we press against, and there's the point. Now if I squeeze between my thumb and finger, and this is the bit that you shouldn't try at home, I apply the same force to both sides. If I push it into a wall, I'm applying the same force to both sides, both the point and the base. Pressure is given by force divided by area. You can define pressure as force per unit area. If you hear the word per, it generally means divide in physics. So the force I'm applying via my thumb is acting over a large area of the pin. And so the pressure is quite low. That same force is being applied to the small area of the point. Now that's sufficient, but it's going to stick into my finger. In the fit my introductory video, you'll have seen the bed of nails. There, my weight is spread over a large number of nails. And so the, the force per nail, the force per unit area is very small. The pressure is low, low enough that it doesn't puncture my skin. Now, the reason you shouldn't try this at home is if you do push too hard, it will go into your finger. Now, I know how far to push it so that it doesn't go to my finger. Pressure. Sometimes we want low pressure. Skis, snowshoes, increase the surface area in contact with the ground, with the snow, and so we don't sink in. Sometimes we want higher pressure with things like nails and pins. High heel shoes with very thin stiletto heels can sometimes cause damage to wooden flooring. I'm not old enough to remember, but somebody once told me that in the 1950s, when stiletto heels first came into fashion, that they were banned from being used in dance halls because of the damage they caused to the wooden floors. A tank. In the army, very heavy, maybe in excess of 60 tons, it can go over soft ground that another vehicle, like a Land Rover, might sink in. If you've enjoyed this video, then please do hit like, please subscribe, please share around with your friends. And if you've got any things that you'd like me to talk about in these videos, then please do leave a comment.